brutal. It's not big in the desert, but on a bus, on bumpy roads. At the moment, I would pay hundred. Loads of road works. I would pay hundred pounds just to be let off. Right, we're going to find the hop on hop off bus. I've never done a hop on hop off bus before. Normally, because sometimes they're in places where you don't need to do that. So, two reasons we're doing it today. One, because we never have, we thought we'd give it a go, we thought it might make an interesting vlog. And two, because Lisbon is hilly, and if we want to see as much of it as we want, we don't want to get too hot walking around, so we figured that would be a really good call. Yeah, it's going to be about 27 degrees today. But it's today not like busy, as hot so as we thought it would. It's going to be okay. Yeah. Wash your smalls, wash your smalls. <laughs> Nothing says class. It's like an apartment block. Mm. Just a tip if you're new to cruising, that's what you don't do. You don't hang your laundry up. So while we were feeling lovely and cool at this point, by the end of the day we were hot messes. Stick around to find out why. So that's what we're doing, but we've already got our tickets. Which one is it, Beth? The grey line or the red? The red ones. These red, red ones. ones. We have tickets. We bought them online. Okay, no problem. So what do we do? We just get on? Okay, thank you. Hope there's space at the top. Is there room up the top? Okay. This is just the normal one, it's not an excursion from the ship, is it? We've got this ticket. No, this is the normal one. Okay, thank you. Okay. So from now on, this is the ticket. Okay, regarda. That's it. <laughs> it was actually four at the back. We didn't get our headphones. Oh, do you want to run down oh, and get some? Here. Music. Music? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're leaving and it's just started talking. Of course, you can always do it yourself. Don't trust us though and our family. So they're talking about a church now, but I can't find any church nearby. Do you see a church? I don't. I'm kind of getting the impression that they just say stuff on this tour. It just says, see this and see this, but it doesn't really correspond to where you are. Team 1 just said this is indistinguishable from Spain. So far I'd agree. So, so far we've gone miles. And this is known as the City of the Seven Hills, or Seven Elevations. So I'm very glad that we didn't try to walk it. Apparently everywhere you turn you can see some sort of elevation or some sort of hill. So Teen One just said that this is like San Francisco, like a Portuguese version of San Francisco. I agree. So some of these trees are really low hanging and they kind of almost hit you. It's a bit like Santa Cruz. Oh look out! So this is called the New Avenues. If by new you I mean the 19th century, which is when they were formed. Go on. We're there now, okay. Oh, but I don't place. know where we went. We didn't stop anywhere. No. I think you just have to stop the red button. I th maybe we had to get here to this point because maybe. we did the red route. A loop around. I think we did that blue loop. So where's number two? Mm. Yes, yeah. King Edward the Seventh Park. This is a lovely view. Really pretty. Yeah. Should we go and take a picture from down here? Yeah. So the hop on hop off dropped us right down there. We walked all the way up here. It's a fantastic view here. Edward the Seventh Park. It's a whole flock of parakeets. Yeah, little parakeets. That's little, little parrots. Parakeets. Can you see them? I can see them. Yeah. Again, it's the bird cries and I know them. <laughs> Just like the eagles. I'm identifying the bird cries. I'm like parakeets. I know that because we have them in, in Kent. There's a flock of parrots that usually goes around There's near more. where I work. But yeah, they're little parakeets. There's more, they're everywhere. I'm the bird whisperer.
that's what we did to come here. I think so. That's what I think. Or we did that. We're going into the centre now. I'm glad we did this. Mm -hmm. It's better than getting a cab, as you said. I bought myself. Five euros. Pretty good. I need it today, but I figured I will once we get down to the mid. Love it. And apparently that is the Prime Minister who helped rebuild Lisbon after the Great Earthquake. Well, that's not him. That's a statue of him. Uh, that's the backside of his dog or a lion or something. I want to ride the little one now. I think you have to be special. Is it special? This is this nice. Is Alto. Yeah, this is lovely. Gonna have to wait for a spot to open up on the gate. Wow. Cool. Forgot about that tram. And here comes another one. And now a public service announcement about the pavement in Lisbon from Bethstad by Beth. They're very slippery, particularly if it's wet. And he's right, because they're all like tiles. Maybe we Bethstad's should. not Portuguese, he just used to do business here. Yeah, these would be quite treacherous in the rain. Yeah. You get sardines for your birth year. Fantastic sardine the fantastic world, world of, of the Portuguese sardine. It's birthday year. I see. Oh, this one, hopefully they're not that age. Yeah. Do you think they're, they're actually from that year though? My year, sardines from my Do you think that's year. actually, they're actually that old? I don't know, I'm sure it's not. It's very cool. Themed sardines. Here we go. They're nine euros. Yeah, it's very fun. World. It's nothing on this. Okay, sit down. That's so cool. I'm not the biggest fan of fish bars, but there's no call for that. We just had we just had lunch somewhere that was just tapas and it was just something to eat, but it's up there and they played non-stop 1980s soft rock hits. It yep. was amazing. So far we were pretty impressed with the hop on hop off bus, we'd seen a couple of places, had a good explore, had some lunch and it started to get hotter and this is when it starts to go a little bit wrong. Yeah, all we wanted to do was hop back on the bus. Maybe one of these buses is there. Just want to get up there. Oh, it might be it. If we can get on it, I'm sure we will. I think it's full. Is this the green one? Yeah. Yeah, and it's full. Absolutely. Right, there's a green bus, and we're it's trying to chase it down because there's actually there's actually spaces on it. Nope, it's going bye bye. Welcome to Traveling Routines, where we ruin our own traveling experiences so you don't have to. We cannot find the red bus anywhere. Well, we tried to get on one, which was like shrunk to a minibus. It was completely full. So, so we now we've walked we're back up where we were because we know there's a bus stop. And now it's, it's just too really hot. not clear. We could have spent a lot less money taking a cab. Okay. Oh. Is it going to stop? No. No. And that's the red one as well. There's another one up there. Yes. Several nice hours here, and 15 it? degrees later. I like this bit. There will that? be the bus stop. Oh, there it is up there at the bus stop. Number five and then green, red five and green four. Ooh, and back, like, an and that's like our afternoon. An Relaxing, sightseeing, okay. what do you want to do? Like to be found, family? It is so hot. Hmm. It's the one we wanted. Oh, we wanted the green one after all. Is there space on it? Yeah. Yep. Seatbelts. Oh, at last. Oh, yeah, seatbelts. Well, that was eventful. Well, at least we got the one we wanted in the end. 
lessons I don't know learned. Where we're going, but we're on it. No. Hopefully to the castle. It's been a long time since we've been anywhere that I've been the one having a scarf. Oh, I know. It's only the right meltdown today. Threw all his toys out. I'm proud. Hard. We've just gotten there. Yeah. And we're trying to get to the Castello Sao George. Mm-hmm. If you had we the... came before it wasn't it wasn't the summer, was it? No, it was springtime. We did it on the way back to Southampton at some point. It might have been in the World Cruise actually. Could have been. Back in the year it. in the year two thousand. So that would have been eight, end of April when we came back from the World Cruise. Yeah. So It was cloudy. I remember. It. Cool, yeah, it was coolish. fine. It was it wasn't too hot. And the only other time I've been was when I was on another cruise and I was here October, November time and that was lovely. Yeah. But it is very hot. We knew it would be hot. That's why we did the buses. But what we didn't think would be so bloody hard to find the damn buses. We'll get on them when we did find them. And we are tantalizingly close to our beautiful air-conditioned ship with a bunch of free food in it. They do like a roundabout statue here though. An important Portuguese question. The, the question on all our lips. You were cold this morning. And you moaned about I it. I know I did. Are you moaning now? I'm not moaning. No. Oh, look, kids, big bend. Oh, we've been around here once. I hope we have been around here once. Here's the back side of that statue. Mm -hmm. So, if you're going to do one of these open top buses in Lisbon, which you're probably not after seeing this video. Wear a hat and sunscreen. It's one of our kids. Going back the way we came, I don't really understand why. It's basically like being driven around in your mate's dodgy convertible on a hot day, going nowhere. And my commentary doesn't work, so we've given up. I think you were in Japanese a minute ago. Oh, I've listened to it in all sorts of languages. No, this is silly now. We are back where we picked the bus up. We just looped around and come exactly back where we picked the bus up before. This is absolutely ridiculous. In case you're wondering what kind of stuff you get to see in a typical This is the green bus though, the stretch. red one might be different. Yeah, but the, no, we saw loads of this stuff on the red as well. This is how interesting it is. I mean, I'm sure there are really interesting things here in this one, but... We're an adventure. Oh my god. Hi. This is like a ride. Oh my god, this slope. Oh, ride that squeaky handbrake. That looks a nice place. Yeah. Yeah. That looks nice too. Mm. This would have been better okay. to walk down. Shadier anyway. Mm. How lovely. I think a good part of the problem here is traffic. Yeah. In a major European capital city. You can find that anywhere. Going back I wouldn't get out of there long. No. Or would you be dressed in black? Well, my way. Oh no, we're, we're swinging around again. Of course we are. Well, this makes no sense. There's the other side of that statue. Oh, these trees, these trees look nice. I'm not sure if I mentioned that before. Big in the desert, but on a bus, on bumpy roads. At the moment, I would pay a hundred. Loads of road works. I would pay a hundred pounds just to be let off. Over there. You can see the sun's behind us. Yeah, there is no shade. Oh, oh, oh. oh I know where we are. Oh, we're like earlier. no closer to that. We are no closer to that castle than we were before. Are we seriously coming up to the place where we? Yeah, the where, we like, where it was got full. The bus before, for goodness sake. We're going to have to get off and we're going to get a heat stroke. <laughs> this is the traffic just doesn't move. Yeah, we're going to get off here. How lovely. 
Oh, right yeah. back where we started from. Oh, shit. I'm soaked. Wow. I'm soaked through my top. Oh, the thing is, we just couldn't sit on that bus any longer. No. The heat. No, we couldn't. It's just awful. Thank God I've got a bellito. Oh, wow. This is lovely. This is gorgeous. How did we even miss this place? I also thought on the hop on hop of us I'd learned something. Like I don't know what that is, but I would have found out. Pictures like that is nice, yeah. It's lovely. This is spits away from the shit and it's lovely. So you can just come here. You don't need to do a hop on hop off bus. Well that was a fail. The bus was, but when we got back it was really lovely actually. I wish we'd just kind of yeah. walked down from the port. But we Stay thought we'll make a real day of it and see lots of it. And we did, we went up to Barrio Alto, which was good. And we saw, um, was it Eduardo? Yeah, the park. The park. Eduardo the 7th. Eduardo the 7th Park. So that was good. But you really don't need to. You can just wander along no. here and you get the architecture. And the, fail was spending, I need. the fail was spending £111 to be driven around places that we could have walked to. Yeah, because the, the traffic's just too bad. Oh well, live and learn. I'm going to have some ice cream on board. Something cold. Getting back on board in Lisbon is quick and easy. You just follow the signs to the ship, go down a few rather grim looking grey corridors and you are back in air-conditioned wonder. And then it was time for Sail Away, which we decided to enjoy from our balcony and saw something we've not seen before. I've never seen jellyfish on a cruise ship. Well, they're not on the cruise ship, are they? They're everywhere. Look at those ones. <gasps> They're crazy. They're bloody everywhere. Look at all these ones over here. It's like the ship's turning them up or something. Wow. It's beautiful. But back to the buses, there are a few companies you can use and actually with hindsight we wished we'd use the Yellow Bus Company on YouTube that gets better reviews so if you are considering doing a hop on hop off bus I would study the route ahead of time and perhaps try a different company. Yeah, here on Travelling with Teens we like to make the videos that we wish we'd seen before we travelled so you don't have to make the same mistakes we do. So if you like that kind of content make sure you click subscribe and the notification bell so you don't miss our weekly videos, most of which are cruise related. Yep. Yeah. Today it's an it's elephant. A I think I think they must. Elephant gas. We didn't get one yesterday. <laughs>